are fighting Boko Haram with weapons Biafran army surrendered to Nigeria 51 years ago. Soldier. Hmm. This one is <laughs> bombshell. A Nigerian army officer engaged in the fight against Boko Haram has alleged that soldiers at the front use updated weapons to fight Boko Haram and ISAP insurgents. The soldier who spoke to Sahara reporters on condition of anonymity said the troops still use guns recovered from the Biafran army after the civil war ended in 1970. He alleged that top army officers, including former chief of army staff Taku Butai, were using the Boko Haram war as an enterprise to enrich themselves at the expense of their lives. Some of their guns were brought by Chukwemeka Odumegu Ojuku for the Biafran army during the civil war. They were handed over to the Nigerian government after he and other leaders of the Biafran army surrendered to General Yakubu Gawan. The bombs given to us by Brutai were made over 50 years ago as well, so we hardly used them, he told Sahara reporters. <laughs> How can this be true? The Nigerian army had recently accused 149 soldiers of the 153 infantry battalion matter of abandoning the Boko Haram insurgents fight and fleeing over a large alleged inadequate provision of arms and ammunition. Sahara reporters gathered that the soldiers Asconded from duty after students attacked their camps, leaving scores of their colleagues dead. These students had on Monday, Friday 15th, overrun Matur. While most of the villagers ran away for safety, some were hurt by the insurgents. Sahara reporters gathered that the gunmen came with heavy machine guns and trucks and took possession of the military formation in the community, including high-profile fighting equipment and vehicles. At least 10 soldiers were killed during the incident. The government also bought two battle tanks and a pickup van belonging to the Nigerian army, said we lost about 10 soldiers in the fight. The troops were outgunned by the government it was an intensive battle. The terrorists also suffered casualties, but they were able to overweigh the soldiers, a military source had said. Sahara reporters gathered that soldiers were moved to Medugri a few days, few days after the attack, while those from Jaji military cantonment Kaduna state were used to replace them. The army authorities sus subsequently dismissed them and retrieved their uniforms and identify cards. They will, however, record a few weeks later. Hmm. This is trouble on the land. Yet, we hear that Mr. President released trillions of Nairas for defense just in the tunnel of Brutai alone. So, no supervision from the presidency and the minister, minister of defense, or even the NAS. Or was it a cause for collusion? This culture of defense expenses never proved is a big problem in this country. How come the service chiefs were compensated further with ambassadorial appointments again? Divide Nigeria to save lives because we Biafrans are here to do the needful. If Nigeria refused to allow us to go, and this time Nigerian government will surrender their own weapon. Meanwhile, Senate are busy screaming former chiefs of staff to be ambassadors. i sorry for those nations. Hmm. Someone said there, yeah, do you mean that the weapons are not 
finishing and that the defense are not buying weapons all this why how many weapons they surrendered don't take people as primary school children sahara reporters blinders if they have the weapons that will last this long i don't think they would surrender like that the military is supposed to handle you for that honestly i I, I am even really surprised that a weapon can stay that long. We are talking about 51 years. Yeah, that is a lot of years you get. I'm surprised. <laughs> so, I don't know. I don't know what to say. Okay, I'm just, I don't just know what to say. Does it mean that uh, the weapons don't, doesn't go bad or what? I don't really know what to say about that. Okay, someone said they are all here, Biafran, many times and forever. We fought for good and for restructuring of the nation, but people with poor mindset disagreed. And today they are talking about the same restructuring. Thank God to Igbos and Biafran nations. So if not Biafran, Nigeria will not have weapons to fight his agency. This means Biafran army are more equipped and gallant than the so-called Nigerian army. Although my daddy told me how formidable and gallant Biafran soldiers were. So hello guys, I'm going to drop it here for now. Kindly hit the comment section and don't forget to give us a thumbs up. Also click on the notification button for more updates. Subscribe to this channel.